Hello, back working on drum and bass track call and response. Got to figure out how to incorporate this sound, maybe shape it a bit better when it comes in, of course. Probably spend most of the video doing that. I kind of like it, but I think I'm going to lose the distortion. Bring this up a bit. I think the secret here is going to be in the operator. Let's um, introduce another oscillator. This is all frequency modulation. I mean, it's all just harmonics, really, isn't it? Be great to have that super spread. It's not going to do anything. What's um leeching the stereo ness of it? So I'm just going to remove these for now. That's got 200%. I can get rid of these. I'll keep the limited there just because we're dealing with a feedback loop. Okay, call me crazy. Go on. I'm going to group these together. I'm going to have um, one on the left, one on the right. So we'll call this left, duplicate this, call this right. So this is going to be left, this is going to be right. Then we change the harmonics in this one a bit. So maybe just go nine, down a few. It's quite ringy. You can hear it really ringing here, so let's uh, let's just have another EQ. We'll just flatten this out. And we need to also do this on the other channel. Whether this is necessary, I'm not sure. Actually, no, what we can do is just have that. Uh, oh, okay. What we can do is have this after everything. stopping there we'll keep it there we'll use the filter to get rid of it the filter needs to go outside of the group as well still not happy with this Try um, just a good old redux. It needs some sort of distortion. I might try playing with a saturator. Yeah, let's play with the saturator and see what happens.
go back here and play with these harmonics. It's a square. That was almost cool. <laughs> Almost. Okay. These guys. So I'm going to delete the automation from that. And I'm going to map frequency of this to macro one and we'll go over to this one delete the automation i have to go out of mapping mode delete the automation map this to the same one Bring the resonance down, right down. Copy to siblings. So I'm going to change the feedback here. It's almost like we don't need the echo now. I spent so many videos trying to make this sound and now we're like undoing all of those knots, but that's okay. So I'm going to turn the echo off on that. I'm going to have to do it on this one as well. Play with this again. interesting change this to a sign
it's so close it's funny because this was the initial sound that this whole track was going to be based around and i spent a long time on it and now i feel like it's the last creative component that i kind of need there's a, a bit to go with the progression and everything but i think once i've cracked this code <laughs> we good all right i'll see you on the next one <laughs>